Hello, how to evaluate with our calculator? This is 9 divided by 4 raised to the power of 9 divided by 4. Now, I can express 9 as 3 to the power of 2. Divided by 4 is simply 2 to the power of 2. Raised to the power of 9 over 4. Now remember, if you have a power c divided by b power c, this equals a divided by b raised to the power of c. So applying that here, you have 3 divided by 2 raised to the power of 2. And this is raised to the power of 9 over 4. Now, what we can do is to consider this other identity. You have a power n raised to the power of n equals a power n times n. So, applying that here, this will give us 3 divided by 2 raised to the power of 2 times 9 over 4. And this will give us 3 divided by 2 raised to the power of 18 divided by 4. So from here, we can simply have 3 divided by 2 raised to the power of 2 cancel this 9. Cancel this, we have 2. We have 9 over 2. So, we can consider this identity then. If you have a power n over m, this equals the m root of a power m. So, applying that here, we will have the square root of 3 over 2, and this is raised to the power of 9, because we have 9 here. Now, the next thing we can do is to consider this other identity again. If you have square root of a divided by b, this equals square root of a divided by square root of b. So, we are simply going to have square root of 3 divided by square root of 2 to the power of 9. Now, from here, if you also have a divided by b raised to the power of c, this equals a power c divided by b power c. So that means you simply have square root of 3 raised to the power of 9 divided by square root of 2 raised to the power of 9. So what is this value of square root of 3 raised to the power of 9? This is square root of 3 times 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 square root of 3 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 times square root of 3 times square root of 3 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 times square root of 3 that's 9 and this is the variable then we have square root of 2 raised to the power of 9 Square root of 2 times square root of 2 times square root of 2 times times square root of 2 times square root of 2 times square root of 2 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 times square root of 2, that is 9. So from here, you have square root of 3 times square root of 3. This is square root of 9 times square root of 3 times square root of 3 root of 9 times, square root of 3 times square root of 3, square root of 9 times, square root of 3 times square root of 3, square root of 9 times, square root of 3, divided by square root of 2 times square root of 2, 
square root of 4 times square root of 2 times square root of 2. Square root of 4 times square root of 2 times square root of 2. Square root of 4 times square root of 2 times square root of 2. Square root of 4 times square root of 2. So from here we simply have square root of 9 is 3 times, 3 times, 3 times, 3 times root 3. That is square root of 9 times 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 square root of 3. Divided by square root of 4 is 2 times square root of 4 again 2 times this we have 2 times this we have 2 and we have times square root of 2. So let's multiply this out. Then we have 3 times 3 that is 9 times 3 times 3, we have 9, times root 3, divided by 2 times 2, we have 4 times 2 times 2, we have 4 times root 2. And from here, we are going to have 9 times 9, that is 81, we have times root 3, divided by 4 times 4, we have 16 and times root 2. So from here, we can simply have that is 81 times root 3, that is 81 root 3, divided by 16 root 2. Now, what we can do again would be to rationalize this denominator. So we are going to multiply the numerator by root 2 and also divide it by root 2. So from here, what we are going to have will be 81 times root 3 times root 2 divided by 16 times root 2 times root 2. And from here we have root 3 times root 2, that's root 6, so we have 81 root 6 divided by we have 16 times root 2 times root 2, that is root 4. So from here, what we are going to have will be 81 root 6 divided by 16 times root 4 is 2. So from here, we are going to have 81 root 6 divided by 16 times 2 we have 32. And there's no number that will divide 81 and 32. So this becomes our answer. So guys, this is it without the use of calculator, 81 root 6 divided by 32. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe and share. Thank you and goodbye.